I'm Sean Gonzalez and you're watching the behind the scenes video for Last Minute Rental for the 2018 My Road Real Short Film Competition. Make sure you check out the short film right now before you watch this one and I hope you guys enjoy. Starting off with the set decoration, what I did was I bought a whole bunch of drop cloths from the dollar store. Probably had about 10 of them and I covered up all the windows in the house. Um, each scene was done separately so it wasn't all done at the same time. Mostly all the downstairs area and uh, the living room and dining room. So I went back in and I covered the windows because it wasn't as dark as I wanted it to. And it actually gave that dark, eerie feeling. I put a couple of paint buckets, some paint brushes and supplies, uh, spread them out through the house, a uh, ladder. And I just wanted to give it that feel of an unfinished house or a house that was worked on that just never got done. I covered the railing, the couches, the television, um, even a couple things on the wall. As you can see, it looks pretty unfinished which is the look that I was going for. The creepy face that you've seen in the dining room shot was just a gorilla mask with some creepy hair and a white mask with no features which turned out pretty scary once it was under the drop cloth and worked out quite well. Most of the film was shot on a tripod so what I had to do was add some camera shake in post production because that's the feel that I was going for. The blood is just some fake blood and jelly from the dollar store and you mix it up and it gives this nice gory brain matter type of effect my nephew did an amazing job Isaiah he can't wait to do the next one this is just a picture frame from school with dry erase marker which came out pretty creepy now my sister was a special effects makeup artist for this film she's an amazing artist and she's doing makeup on Juan Matos my scary clown actor he did an amazing job it's a shame that I deleted some footage and I had to do the best that I could with my dollar store makeup to try to imitate what my sister did. You can't really tell because my head covers one of the shots that I did and then her shot was this one which had all the detail on it. Pulling myself into the closet was actually harder than it looks but I was able to do it and it looked pretty good from the hallway. I actually ordered a 40 year old jack in the box off of eBay. This thing is older than me. It's beat to hell but looks great and it worked in the scene. The camera setup I used for this film was a GH4 in anamorphic mode, an anamorphic lens, the SLR magic rangefinder, the Rode Video Micro, and a 7 inch field world monitor. Editing this film was so much fun. I've seen it over and over in my head a thousand times. I knew exactly what I was doing, the look I was going for, and it turned out great. Thanks for watching. Make sure you vote for the short film and this behind the scenes video. And I'll see you guys next year.